Hello everyone and welcome to the Secret Stage Gaming News for March 7th, 2016. I'm your host Jared. It has been a crazy busy weekend featuring a review that Miguel and I did for Witch in 100 Night and me and Miguel and Ramsey's getting together to talk about the Nintendo Direct while playing Mario Maker. Both those videos are up. You can find them on our channel. They are crazy. I'll try to add links in the description if I remember to do so. But in the meantime, let's get through the news. First off, we have a couple cancellations that people might find interesting. First, Microsoft is canceling production on Fable Legends. What's interesting about this is that the beta will still be sticking around for a little bit, at least according to some sources. However, on a sad note, this cancellation may be the first step towards shutting down Studio Lionhead over in the UK. There was no clear reason given as to why this game has been canceled, but it has been in production for a while, so it seems strange that they would cut it off so close to its completion. Second cancellation comes from a lesser known game called Bear Simulator. The creator of the game has cancelled the Kickstarter. This was due to drama and negative response for the game. The game is still up in the Steam store and the creator will be working on fixing a few issues before officially giving up on the game. On the soon to be released news, we got a couple of stories here. First, Ace Attorney 6 has its official release date for Japan, June 9th. However, there is no official Western release date yet. However, it has been confirmed that yes, it will be coming out after the Japanese release. I would expect it sometime in fall or winter. As mentioned by Ramses yesterday, Overwatch has its release date finally set for May 24th. However, there will also be a beta from May 5th through 9th, and people will be able to enter the beta early if they pre-order the game. However, bear in mind all your data from the beta, including rewards, money, and all that, will not transfer over to the main game, consider it more of an extended demo. If you're looking forward to some Overwatch action, it'll be releasing on PS4, Xbox One, and PC at the end of May. Finally, our last story is kind of a rumor, but kind of not. It begins with the leak that there will be a Zelda-themed Picross game that will be coming out later this month and will be Twilight Princess-themed. The rumor side of it comes in the fact that it may be a My Nintendo reward. There's no word on what kind of reward this will be, if it'll be something given to all early adopters, or if it will be purchased via points, or unlocked via certain merchandise. Hopefully, that information should be available very soon. And that's the news. A little bit shorter this time around, because I covered some of the Saturday news on my last news program, which was a Saturday news. Which always makes this a little easier when I'm only covering two days instead of three. Anyhow, as always, like subscribe, and share our videos so everyone online can hear the news and check out all our cool reviews and streams. Speaking of streaming, you can always find us on Twitch and Hitbox under the Secret Stage name. Links are in the description. If you want to get all our latest news and updates, you can follow the Secret Stage team on Twitter at SR underscore Secret Stage, or follow me on Twitter at Jared the Greek. Hope you enjoyed the show. Until next time, my name is Jared, and that's the way the news goes.